Hey, it's Jam. And really quick, I just wanted to give a huge shout out to my friends over on Patreon. Specifically, Yoretta, Fudge Unicorn, Phoebe, Janet Ashcroft, Alexa, Nooms, and more. Thank you all for being patrons. I really, really appreciate it. If you would like to become a patron and get your lovely name on this lovely list on screen right now, and a possibility of a special shout-out, consider checking out my Patreon down below. If not, that's completely fine. I hope you enjoy the video anyway. Thank you guys. Bye-bye. Hello there, servant. I mean loyal employee. Would you mind coming up to my office really quick? I have personally selected you to be the sinner that takes part in my newest scheme. I mean, super secret, very special assignment. Oh, don't you worry about that report. If you're head of a boss has anything to say about me relocating you, well, best not say it over the phone what I'd do with him. Yeah, well, turns out even companies down here need an HR. I'll never hear the end of it, I swear. But that's besides the point. Come on up here for more details on that special assignment I've got for you. Great! I know you'll just love it. See you soon. Two hours later. Ah! There you are! I feel like I've been waiting for hours! What took so long? Uh-huh. We really do have to find a better way of getting people up here. This building is too tall and that elevator is too slow. <clears throat> That's a matter for a different time, though. And don't you worry. You'll never have to take that elevator again. Well, it's because of your new job, of course. You see, it comes with certain benefits that would make actually performing your job significantly easier. For example, you won't have to worry about long commutes to work anymore. New office. <laughs> uh, yeah, you could say that. You'll definitely have a different view than what you're used to, that's for sure. This is a non-negotiable promotion, meaning what you get is what you get. What is the promotion? <laughs> Let's just say I've taken a liking to you, and I see the way you stare in awe as I pass through the building. Uh, your face is telling me that you're starting to understand. Good. Very good. It seems like you still need help, though. I'll sum it all up by saying that we'll be working very close together from here on out. Do you understand? Don't you worry about the details. They'll come later. Just say that you'll do it. Oh, great! I knew you'd be in. What's next?
<sighs> well, this part's where it gets tricky. Oh, that? That's just a mild tranquilizer. Don't worry, it'll wear off soon. Think of it as the beginning of your, uh, initiation. Like the start of your training. Honey, you're in good hands. Trust me. <laughs> Yeah, tie their hands together. Hey! I said tie, and that's all you will do! Hurt them and I will cut you open and fuck the hole! Oh shit, they're waking up. Get out! Now! <sighs> God, I swear imps are some of the dumbest beings in all of hell. Oh, hey there! Seems that you're awake. Tell me, how do you feel? Ah, uh, yes, 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 of course. Groggy, tired, probably a little sore, yes. That's all very normal for what just happened. I already told you, silly. You were injected with a light tranquilizer that made you much more... Well... Tranquil. Ha 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 ha. I assure you that it was super necessary for the next step of your training process. So you noticed the ropes tying you to that chair. Again, very necessary for the training process. The training process of your new job, of course. Didn't I mention it back at the office? Ah, there it is. It seems the pieces are finally clicking in your mind as you remember our previous conversation. Ha ha ha! Look at you, my smart little cookie! You noticed that I said back at the office, implying that we're no longer at the office. This whole thing keeps getting more and more interesting, huh? Oh, wipe that worried look off your face. You're perfectly safe. I personally see to that. That is, if you don't do or say anything that may... compromise our relationship. My point is that you shouldn't worry for your safety in the least. You and I are the only two here, and as I said back at the office, I've taken quite the liking to you. <clears throat> right. The promotion. It would probably be helpful if you actually knew what you agreed to. You see... Hmm... How do I put this? Ah! Well, I guess I'll just come out and say it. We are alone, after all. Being the CEO and wildly successful owner of the largest tech company in the Pride Ring isn't all that it's cut out to be. It's honestly really stressful. And that leaves me to be quite lonely as the connections I've made in my life are purely business related. Yes, yes, I have... Uh... Certain needs met by Val and my various friends that hang around his floor. But that's all shallow, you know. Very surface level. No. What I'm looking for is something much deeper. I crave a true, honest connection. You understand? Right! So, when I saw you among the scum and dirt that are the other imps and sinners that you're surrounded with daily, I knew that I couldn't let you rot down there and lose your shine. Basically, your job is to be there for me when I need you. Massage, relax, and be that connection that I crave so much. <laughs> what could you possibly mean that's not a real connection? You know, I have seen literally all of television, right? 
I think I know how people behave, and definitely how relationships are supposed to work. Relationships like that shouldn't be treated as jobs. Oh, what do you know? You're just some person tied to a chair. You don't know a thing about relationships. You know what? This was one huge mistake. You should go. Your restraints are gone. The door is right there. If you tell anyone about this... Well, I don't think you need me to tell you what would happen. Just leave me alone. What did I s- uh, What are you still doing here? And why are you so close to me? You- You want to help me. I believe I was quite clear when I told you to leave. I don't need your help. It was dumb of me to think that I could have a real connection down here. Especially with the way that I am. <laughs> so, you believe anyone can change, and everyone deserves a second chance? Including me. <sighs> I suppose, in order to get to this goal I'm trying to reach, I should at least go along with you. Don't be surprised if it doesn't work out between us. I have what angels, sinners, and imps call... Issues. We'll have to go over my list of sins another time. There's a more pressing question I need to ask. How do you plan on... <sighs> teaching me your ways? <laughs> Compassion. Not a lot of that down here. But it's not unheard of. Right, focus less on the rest of hell, and focus more on you. <clears throat> How do I know... How do I know to trust you? <sighs> I must say, you're really good at that. But if a kiss alone shows trust, well, let's just say there's a lot of people that trust a lot of people down here. You know what I mean? But it's a decent start. <laughs> 